This program has been brought to you by Alpine Bank. Dedication you can count on and experience you can trust. Alpine Bank, member FDIC. For many Colorado residents, a beautiful home with great views is an important part of living here. So how about improving your soundscape with a sound garden? Pagosa Springs artist and craftsman Ross Barable creates beautiful instruments that make music with nature at Harmony Wind Harps. The wind harp has been alive and well for centuries. Most cultures have their own form of wind harp, but what I bring to this art form is building them out of metals in a sculptural format so they can be outdoors, they can last forever, and using sacred geometry to build the different designs. I used to put 44 strings on a harp. Now, the maximum number of strings I put on a harp is 18 and I tune it to a very, very simple tuning, like a, a fifth or a sixth, a really recognizable interval that is globally recognized as harmony. It's extremely light. If I can fit that up there. Perfect. So this is, this is my latest wind harp. It's totally made out of titanium. It's actually got nine faces on it. Each face is an equal surface area. When I build wind harps that are based on the principles of sacred geometry, they resonate and align with the human body because the human body is really the ultimate sacred geometrical form. The sacred geometry creates the shape of the flowers down to the spin of the nautilus shell, up to the giant spin of galaxies as they expand in the cosmos. There we go. There we go. My first love is the harp, the folk harp that you play with your hands, made out of wood. In my younger days, I built hundreds of these harps. That's how I got into the wind harps initially. And when I was outdoors playing at a vent, the wind would come up and start blowing through the strings. To me, it sounded like an angelic choir. I started building these harps in 1980, and I've built about 500 wind harps. They're all over the world, mostly in North America. Private residences have bought them. I've done many large-scale public installations. For a hospice, it's really a gift for me to be able to have an installation at a place like Mercy Hospital because hospice is an experience that's about transition. When we translate, that soul leaves the body and moves on in its spiritual journey, and it's just like the wind. It just comes and it goes. You don't know where it's coming from and you don't know where it's going, but it has this presence to it that is very ethereal, very, very spiritual. And to have this instrument that captures this energy from the wind really reflects the full spectrum randomicity of nature. If you're interested in learning more about Ross Barable and Harmony Wind Harps, visit his website at harmonywindharps.com.